about the things you want to improve. Pray and meditate more regularly, exercise, eat better, manage your time better, spend more time with those who matter most, read books that grow your mind, focus on the things at church that will make the biggest difference. Do you feel overwhelmed? In The One Thing, Gary Keller and Jay Papazan write that if you want to see positive change in your life, you need to think big and act small. This one little saying changed my life. Back in 2016, I set two major goals for myself, to start a blog and to write a book. Since I was pretty good at establishing habits, I decided I would add 30 minutes of focused work to my morning routine. It worked. In one year, I started a blog, published 28 blog posts, and wrote a 35,000 word manuscript, all in about 30 minutes per day for an average of five days per week. You can have big goals for your life. If you think about them and you get excited, that's great. If you think about them and get overwhelmed, then you need to break it down into smaller chunks. This will help you maintain your passion and perseverance. Why? Because progress is your biggest motivator. When you think big and act small, your focus will be on doing one thing, a little thing, to move toward your big goals. And each time you move forward a little bit, each time you get closer to your goal, you get a boost of inspiration and motivation. The challenges facing church leaders today can be overwhelming. To face them, you need to be at your best. You need a growth mindset and you need grit. These are hard to maintain if you get overwhelmed. So think big and act small. When you do this, God will get you there.